the son has been a fantastic captain in the previous season, scored a hat trick obviously against Burnley earlier in the season. I think he's got a year left on his contract, a bit potentially with an option. Mm. Um, you mentioned last week that some good players might have to go, but I'm presuming that Son's one of the players that you're going to build this team around. Geez, that's a huge leap for you, mate. Eh? What, a, what a bold prediction that's, that I, that Sonny will be part of our future. Yeah, no, he's, he's going to be part of our future, mate. Yeah, it's all right. Thanks, mate. And, and we've asked you this before, but it still seems pertinent. Do you, do you care if you're in the top four or not? And have you given up? <coughs> oh, mate, you really think I'd... Like that's that's a harsh term. Give up. What does that mean? That I come in here at twelve o'clock, have a latte, and then go home and just let the guys train. I mean, I don't give up in anything, mate. I'm, I'm here fighting tooth and nail every single day for everything I can get for this football club because that's my responsibility. I would not give up on any cause, even the 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 most lost of causes, because then I'd be abstaining from my responsibility so I want us to finish the season strong I want us to try and win three games of football and see where that takes us um, I'd never said that I didn't care about finishing top, top four what I said was that finishing top four does not mean we're going to be um, the team I want us to be next year that's not what's going to define us so I don't give up and I'd be surprised if anyone in my position um, at this level would would go in with anything other than a 100% commitment to fight for everything because if you don't, invariably you fail.